Hello folks, Jason and Maddie here with Rivers West Auction. We're at our final auction in the barn for 2022. So we're just gonna walk around and show you about what's going on in this virtual preview. All right, folks, uh, we are in the east wing here and I'm just gonna show you a little bit. We've got a bunch of these porcelain dolls. They're pretty cool. We've got some good vintage and primitive type furniture lots of signs in this sale like this metal old gold sign uh, you can just kind of see here some wood signs so on like that now we're gonna walk around here and and uh, i'll just kind of show you the we've got some some great vintage toys um there's some actually really neat artwork in this particular sale too. Some of it's original, some of it's uh, not, but you want to take a look at the art. A primitive uh, trainer stool for a, a kid. And I kind of blew by on this side. I'll just show you. There's some, there's some really neat vintage uh, uh, glassware, some live traps. Looks like a box full of copper down there. Um, some nice high-end tools. Bag full of decoys over there. Some cream cans. Actually, I thought I saw a cream separator too. It must be uh on the other side but yeah take a look some good pneumatic air tools so this sale here also has uh, a good lineup of uh, slot machines there's some dollar slots uh quarter slots here's a nice vintage mills hera dollar slot uh, pretty old school there's a dime slot and some more nickel slots gonna give you a look at some of these there's a nickel machine there and in a super continental by Bailey a lot of ballets machines here in this sale one of the ballet no handle slots there there's a Circa Circus uh, from, I believe, Sweden uh, take, takes quarters, but it was a Krona machine. One Krona. So walking back down here, I miss these wagon wheels. A nice lineup of wagon wheels. There's a crib. There's a couple of freezers in this sale. I'll show those from the front side. Some good uh, primitive and antique and just good solid furniture as well uh, again lots of signs in this sale there's a there's a BF Goodrich sign a nice metal one there's Tony the Tiger um, a lot of hard cases sorry my dogs are enjoying the preview as well power tools uh, tents. Uh, there's an old vintage uh, uh, baby buggy trunks. More porcelain dolls. And then baby rockers, bassinet crib, something to that effect. Uh, neat lineup of old antique uh, cameras. Some old Disney VHSs. Some of them are the black diamonds. Uh, two cases of these uh, television uh, wall hangers, brand new in the box. Who would need that many, but there's some more copper here. Some big old cannon shells, really nice china. We've got, uh, there's a whole stack of these postcards that came out of the trunk 
they're they're from the 19 early early 1900s from all over it's a really neat lot some old homesteader pictures and calendars and such we got some uh, some uh, trainer cross-country skis look like they're pretty cool vintage skis anyways let's move on to the other side all right in the main hall of the barn we've got some great uh, we've got uh, some great antique sewing machines there's a singer here and an occidental uh, some more big signs there's a greyhound sign a coke sign a zenith sign um, these are the plastic ones that would light up really neat uh, signs there we've got a whole bunch of these uh, magazines several different types some uh, vintage uh, video game equipment uh, you want to take a look at all that we've got lots of oil lamps just uh, dozens of them and a whole bunch of stuff underneath the counters there's a cream separator there's a looks like a change of bus coin machine part of a propeller scales and choppers and hoppers and grinders and braces and bits there's there's quite a bit of stoneware in this sale really yeah folks uh, look at this net this is all one net looks like it's i don't know how long it's it's really quite a deal we've got some good working neon lights there's a bubble gum machine more scales forges and leather clothing and carhartt clothing yep again more there's another nice platform scale a u.s standard televisions boxes and boxes of watches some new uh, baby toys here and a lot more of these uh slot machine parts for you collectors of the slot machines We've got an upright freezer, a chest type freezer. Oops. We've got a piano. It's a early or late 1800s Schultz piano. Lots of tools, cabinets of microwaves. And I think what I'll do is walk down this aisle and show you both sides of it. Motors and winches. Some really nice rigid uh, planer and, uh, and a sander. Another bus uh, coin machine. Some presidential stuff from Carter and Mondale. License plates. I mean, it just goes on and on, folks. The, uh, the electicness of this sale is is uh, fun. There's there's a whole bunch of levels. and I don't know how many hundreds of uh, video games. PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, Xbox 360s. Some vintage and antique telephones. Super fun sale, folks. More of those video games, boxes and boxes of them. Lots of hardware, fasteners, tools. Pop-up tents, auto parts. Just a little bit of everything. There's a there's a really nice uh, vintage Kodascope, uh, eight millimeter player there. There's a wolf trap, hubcaps, and we're getting into some pretty fun stuff too down here. Again, some some uh, good artwork and and uh, uh, native stories uh, books. Here we've got some uh, in television games from the 70s, some Atari games, 
Nintendos, there's an original Nintendo, whole bunch of Intellivision games there, more PlayStation 2 games, and then we get into the first part of the lineup of uh, toy trains and engines, HO scale most of it, most of it brand new, um, but probably 30, 40 years old, all in boxes, just tons and tons of uh, trains and I've got over on the other side we've got a whole nother lineup I'll show you when we get down that way artwork and this is just an empty case yep more stoneware and porcelain some pillars televisions and monitors Here's another one of those coffin style violin cases. Look at this assayer scale. Absolutely gorgeous. It's like some Barbie dolls that are new in the box that are 20 plus years old. You want to take a look at those. And we've got some stuff that isn't quite cataloged yet here, but it will be. Uh, we're going to work on getting a bunch of that done. We've got this old hot point stove here. Oh, I'm going to jump over on the other side here, but got an old Packard spare tire wheel, hubcap, Evinrude motor. Oh, we've got some uh, propellers I forgot. Oh, I forgot to show you these guys. We've got a railroad switch. And we've got these uh, jockey, cast iron uh, jockeys. It's like about a six foot plus McCulley uh, alloy propeller. 1963 calendar, a regulator clock. Kind of being pretty thorough here showing you this whole deal. We're we're about through here. We've got one more big aisle to go down through. It looks like a juicer, antique juicers, beautiful steel cabinet, beautiful, uh, looks like a chest here. Tobacco plug cutters. Some old quart cans of uh, motor oil. You don't see that very often anymore. A bunch of cast iron. More of the cameras. Cream separators. Take a look at this uh, transit. Oops, sorry. With the tripod. Again, here we've got more of the this is a complete vintage set this here is bigger than the ho i can't remember what it's an o scale maybe lots of uh more way cool artwork and then lots of trains um tracks and sets and Models, some of them, like say, new in the box, haven't been assembled yet. If you're into trains, it's a great one. I'll point out here we've got an original Tony Sandoval um, painting. A really uh, looks like it's from 1979. It's an oil painting in great shape. More trains over here. See here, I kind of blew by some of this, some pulleys and rope. Thanks for uh, taking the time to watch this with us. I want to point out we've got a bunch of glass cases that will be that are in this sale. This whole row, it looks like there's six of the or eight of the big cases. Two, four, six of the seven one two three anyways a whole bunch of the big glass cases <laughs> and a small one as well 
and uh, there's a canoe outside, a 16 foot uh, Coleman canoe, and that is also in the sale. And take a look here, folks. We've got an 18 foot step ladder, a 12 foot step ladder, and then a nice extension ladder. So golf clubs, the whole works. Again, folks, uh, this sale is open and it's live right now. We're previewing in person Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday here at the barn. We'll have signs out on the highway. And uh, it begins closing on Wednesday evening, about 5, 5.30 in the evening, it'll start closing. So get your bids in. There's about 700 lots in this sale and uh it's good stuff good fun stuff so at any rate thanks for taking the time to view this uh preview this uh, virtually and if you can come down in person and really look through this stuff